Now what we're going to do is we're going to come back into the comp. We're going to go up to project. We're going to drop in our let's see, fly comp 2. Drop that above the uh, second video that we have right here. Drag it all the way down right here. And see it's going to come back and there it is. There's our little video. Okay, so, um, oh, I didn't know I already had one in here. Well, we're just going to delete this long one. Um, so now we have this right here. Now what we're going to do is we're going to toggle switch modes. Um, we're going to click on here, go to Luma Mat. There you go. And then we're going to uh, Command D the uh, fly video. Bring it out. Drag it out. So, let me figure out. Hold on. Never mind. We'll go back to Nomad real quick and just duplicate this. And then we'll do the Luma mat. So now you see that we have him right here. And now when we uh, apply the uh, ground crack. We'll put it right behind uh, these two right here. We will grab it. Let's see. Oh, move the wrong one. Grab the ground crack. Shrink it down. About this right here. Set it where it looks like it would look like it would be pretty good. Don't worry about that right now. We'll get we'll get back to that. And then overlay. There you are. And see it looks like he's stepping on it, not it like being hovered o hovering over him. See like if we get rid of this right now, you can see how it's right there over top of him, over top the video. But when we apply that effect that we just made looks like he's standing on top of it. All right, so that looks pretty good for right now. Let's see. We want it to be where he lands, so let's go back. Let's put it right here. And then we're going to make another adjustment layer to, you know, same thing uh, that we did right here. So basically, we're just going to duplicate it. M. Let's delete this mask and make a new mask. Um, grab the pen tool. This doesn't have to be perfect at all. Um, go ahead. Oop. What happened there? Sorry about that. Alright. Let's get her around him. And then we're done. All right, so we want to click U, find where we did all of the effects, and drag them out right where we want them to appear again. So see that we have the glowing effect and everything going on. And uh, we're going to have to fix that bulge. So we'll come back. We'll probably mess with the emboss again, the emboss again, whatever it's called. Um, let's see, don't mess with this, the position of it, put it right here, I have to mess with the height, take it up to the, uh, width of the, uh, mask, let's move this, one a little bit more, all right, that looks pretty good for now. All right, but we're gonna have to feather it. So, double M, feather. That's looking pretty good right there. Not gonna lie. So, um, 
click on that. Let's see, let's see how this looks. You can tell how his uh, hand comes out of the uh, shot, though. All right here. You can see all that right there. We want to get rid of that. So we might as we might just want to uh, uh, duplicate the fly video. Is that what I did last time? No, I did not. Let's see. Let's duplicate these two again. No. Well, we're just gonna go back into the this right here and fix it up. You see all these black spots and everything. We don't want that. We want all that fixed. Um, so we're just creating the effect right now. We'll go back into it and fix that part. Um, let's see. Now we're going to get the uh, dust wave. We're going to bring the second dust wave in. Click it on right there. We're going to drag it out to where we want it to start. Put it right here. I'm going to move it up a little bit. All right here. We'll double click this square again for the dust wave and mask it. Um, we'll grab that. Let's see. Move it. Move the, uh, grab the mask. Move it up a little bit. All right here. Feather it. Now when it hits the ground, launches. Let's actually make this, uh, let's actually scale this up a little bit. See how that looks right now. Let her render a good bit just to get a feel for what it looks like. All right. This seems a little fast. We'll extend this. The one back there, the one in the background is pretty good, but let's see. <laughs> Alright, that's pretty good. I just realized the effects are not starting early enough. Start them right here, right before he gets to the, uh, right before he appears. Oop. Hit the wrong button there. Get rid of that. Still seems a little fast. Get this out. Well, that's good for right now. Um, we'll.